Great day everyone! Welcome back to Ram's Tutorial. If you are new here in my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you are updated on my latest videos. Today in class, our viewers, we are going to discuss about our topic, Division of Fractions. Remember class, that Division of Fractions, when we divide this one, Fractions, is that we are going to write division as related to multiplications in which you multiply the dividend by the reciprocal of the divisor by how so for example number one our first problem is 3 7 divide 3 5 chair how can i solve that remember division of fractions so i i don't have any idea about how to solve it here we go please watch my videos first we are going to write Okay, I'm going to write here for solution, the word solution. Please follow guys. So I'm going to write 3, 7, divide 3, 5. This is how we're going, you're going to read the fraction 3, 7, divide 3, 5. We're going to write, this is for number 1 class. I'm going to write 3, 7. Next, this division symbol, we're going to change to multiplication symbol. Okay, that's easy. Next, 3 fifth, we are going to reverse. The denominator becomes numerator. Then, numerator becomes denominator. Okay, what is the next thing we do? Simply, we're going to multiply numerator to numerator, denominator to denominator next three times five class so we're going to multiply it by three or by five skip counting so our answer is 15 over seven times three is 21 now we are going to find it out that 15 over 21 is proper fraction now we're going to find it out their gcf or their greatest common factor so the GCF between 15 and 21 is 3. So we're going to divide it 1. 15 divided by 3 is 5. 21 class divide to 3, and that is 7. So our answer now is 5, 7. I'm going to put it here, ENS. That's for number 1. Okay? Next, number 2. We have, we're going to write 18 divide 1 fifth. We're going to write it, the first fraction, 8, 10. So change division symbol to multiplication symbol. Reverse it, denominator becomes numerator. 5, 1. So step by step tie class, K okay, viewers. 8 times 5, we're going to write here, 40. 10 times 1, we're going to write 10. Now, how to simplify that? Simple. 40 is greater than 10, which is our denominator. We're going to divide it here. 40 divide 10. How many 10 in 40 class? We're going to write 4 times 10 is 40. When we multiply, when we subtract rather, okay, it's 0. So our answer now, 40 over 10 is what we call 4, is our answer in what we call, when we simplify that. Okay, because this is 40 and then 10. Okay, so 40, so 10 times 4, 40. Okay, that's correct. Next here. Number three, this is another way in solving division of fraction because in number three we have 12, 13, divide 8, 39. So we're going to write guys 12, 13, multiplication symbol, remember? Next. So we're going to reverse it 39 over 8 
So we're going to multiply 12 times 39. I will show you. So 2 times 9, guys, 8, 10. You group 1 times 3 plus 1, that's 7, 9, then 3. So 8. We're going to add 7 and 9. 9 plus 7. Okay, that is... How many guys? What is the answer? That is 16. So we group 1, 3 plus 1. So that's 4. So we're going to write here 4, 68. Then we're going to multiply 13 and 8. 3 times 8, guys. 24, we group 2. 1 times 8 is 8 plus 2. That's 10, 104. Okay. So we're going to divide, guys. 468. 468 divide 104. So we're going to think how many 468 and 104. So we're going to write first here. Okay, 4. And then we're going to multiply. There's another space here. So we have first here 104. 16 for 16 so we're going to subtract 8 minus 6 is 2 6 minus 1 is 5 so our answer here is 4 and what we called 52 over 104 this is where we are final answer But I have an, another idea, guys, in how to solve number three. So what is our another idea in solving number three? We have, I'm going to rewrite. This is another, this is another way on how to solve this division of fractions. So from this given number three, 12 over 13 divided eight over 39. So we have first another also solution on how to answer number three problem. Okay, in solving division of fraction, I'm going to write, guys. So this is what we call another, another way in solving division of fraction. Another steps or what you call the ways. I'm going to write number three again. Ito yung ibang paraan po. Which do you prefer? Kung okay po sa inyo to. So then, kung, kung okay kayo sa first method ko, then pwede din doon. So all we have to do guys, write mo natin yung 12, 13 here. Yan. Then change to multiplication symbol. So we're going to write here 39 over 8. Chair, ano po yung another method? So next guy here, we're going to find the factor of 12. So we're going to write here 4 times 3 because we know guys that the factor of 12 is 4 times 3. Then we copy the multiplication symbol here. Next we're going to find the factor of 39. So remember the factor of 39 is 13 guys times 3. So when you multiply yung guys, pakita ko po sa iyo, I will show you 13 times 3, if I'm not mistaken. 3 times 3 is 9, 1 times 3 is 3, that's 39. So sa 12, when you multiply 4 times 3, the answer is 12. Okay? Next guy, ito na po si 13 at saka sa 8, so we put the uh, division of fractions. So we're going to write first here, 13 here. Then we're going to factor 8, which is 2 times 4, Okay? Almost done na po tayo. We're going to proceed to the next step. Now we are going to apply our cancellation of common factors or common terms. So we have first here. Okay. We have here 4, then 4, 13, and 13. 
right? So, ang natira guys, 3 and 3. So, we're going to write here 3 times 3 over 2. Okay, that's easy guys. You multiply 3 times 3, the answer is 9. Okay, you copy 2. So, 9 over 2, our answer po. So, now we are going to simplify. We are going to divide 9 and 2. 9 divide 2 rather. So, how many 2 in 9? So, we have first here 4. 2 times 4 is 8. 9 minus 8, guys, is 1. Okay, so our final answer, this is what we call simplified already, guys. 4 and 1 half. Okay? Did you follow me, guys? Hope this video will entertain you a lot and then you learn from my ways on how to divide fractions in different way short method and long method if you are new here again in my channel don't forget to subscribe so that you are updated on my latest videos once again good day and thank you for watching god bless everyone happy weekend